Hey everybody, it's Rich Brooks of The Marketing Agents and today I have something very cool to share with you. I'm going to show you how you can create an external link, a link to your website or a landing page, right from within a YouTube video. You're not going to need any fancy third party software and you're not going to have to jump through all the hoops that we used to have to do with the overlay ads. This is just a new option that's in annotations. I just discovered it the other day. I wanted to share it with you. So if you do any sort of YouTube marketing, you know you want to drive traffic to a website or landing page or sign up page. And in this video, I'm going to show you the steps you need to do to set it up so your account is going to be ready so you can create those external links. You ready to go? Let's check it out. First thing you're going to want to do is go over to your YouTube account. Log in. And then you're going to go to your video manager. From there, you're going to click on channel settings and then choose Associated Website. Here's where you're going to enter in your website URL. Now that we've got that done, we're going to head over to Google Webmaster Tools. Now, if you haven't set up Google Webmaster Tools for your website yet, you're going to have to do that. And it seems to me that you're going to have to have the same Google account associated with your YouTube channel and with your Google Webmaster Tools. Once that's been done, you can continue. So here I am in my Google Webmaster Tools and I select the website that I'm focusing on. I go over to the menu and click on Configuration and then Associates. And here I'm going to add a new user to Associates. I'm going to select YouTube and I'm going to enter in the email address that's associated with my Google account. click add and now you can see that my uh, the account has been created and it's associated with my YouTube channel back to YouTube now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to verify my account as a partner Google or YouTube is then going to text me to make sure that I actually am who I say I am so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put in my phone number now quite honestly I don't remember that I associated this with any of my accounts but I just put in my cell phone number submitted it. A moment or so later Google texts me and then I just go in and I enter that code. Once I've done that I click on verify and it works. Now you go back into your video manager, you go to annotations and you'll see this big blue bar at the top. You're going to enable the external links. Once that's done, you can start adding annotations which create links to your external website. At least that's what you think. So I go in and I choose a spotlight option and I make it nearly invisible and I create a link and I choose to pull down to associated website and I enter in the URL that I've already set up, www.flight.biz and it tells me it's not valid. Now it seems to me that it takes about a minute or two for this to actually work or maybe you just need to go back out and then come back in again. So here I am going back in again. The blue bar is gone. I choose Spotlight again. I move my clickable link over to the Flight New Media logo. I select Link. I go down to Associated Website and I type in the same URL again and this time it works. I save my work. I go back to my video play it and then as you can see I look I roll over the flight logo click on it and it becomes an external link that goes right to my website so pretty cool right I thought it was pretty interesting that's why I wanted to share it with you now if you're creating YouTube videos and you're gonna put this to use let me ask you a favor can you give me a big thumbs up down below and then maybe share this video with your social networks that would be great until next time this has been Rich Brooks of the marketing agents